Hi, this is Carrie White with It's Tech TV. I'm here today with David Scott from Lockheed Martin. David, thanks for being here. Thank you. Glad to be here. So, you have a lot going on in this booth. Tell me what you brought to It's Tech this year. Uh, so behind us we have a uh, C-130 multifunction training aid. So this is a device that's used to train C-130 air crew. So it's a type of a device that's easily reconfigurable and that we can change the configuration to match the user's uh, aircraft. So it's a, a trend we see within the industry of creating higher quality, higher fidelity devices that are more affordable. So we're always looking at how we can train the pilots and, and crew members the most uh, efficiently. And that involves moving from the more expensive training uh, platforms down into devices such as this one. So Lockheed Martin provides a full range of training devices and services, all the way from dome simulators through multifunction training aids down to desktops, laptops, tablets. So it's linking all those together in a seamless fashion. Wonderful. Now, you mentioned something to me earlier today about turnkey training. Tell me about that. So turnkey training is a business model where Lockheed Martin is responsible for all the aspects of initial pilot training. So we procure the airplanes, the simulators, the courseware, and we put it all together in a training program that guarantees a predictable outcome at a, a fixed price for customers. So we do introductory pilot training now for two countries in the UK and with Singapore, and we're pending uh, a contract in Australia in the near future. How big do you want to get that turnkey training to be? So there's quite a lot of interest in this business model and this approach because of its benefits. A reduced cost, guaranteed pilot outcome, predictability. And so we're seeing a lot of interest internationally uh, throughout Asia Pacific, throughout the Mideast, as well as Europe. So it's, it's a business model that's really starting to resonate in the marketplace. So where is Lockheed Martin going in the future? So we're focused on uh, wearable technologies, uh, areas we can incorporate into individual training, so taking the displays and putting them onto the person. Uh, we're working on live virtual constructive where we link in all the domains, the live asset, the virtual simulated asset in a constructive environment, and also doing things in the most affordable and efficient fashion possible. Always focused on uh, getting the training tasks done so we can produce the operators needed for our customers. Dave, thank you for taking the time to speak with me today. You're obviously very busy here with Lockheed Martin. So have a great day, and for more coverage, stay tuned to ITSEC TV.